How was your day? Busy? Doing what? I'm never doing anything, am I? No, 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 I just want to know <laughs> doing what. Okay, because sometimes you feel like I'm not doing anything, I'm just watching TV. That's basically what you do on weekends. <laughs> really? I can feel it. It's just a couple of strands. Hold on. Are you going to cut it? Yes. Why would you come back here? It's I not, babe, it's not here. It's a couple of strands. Oh no, one of them came off. Oh well, we'll fix that, I guess. Now this is cold water. So will you pull it down? Yep, it's cold. So cool now. Oh, well, let's see how we did. And one of them already fell out. Okay. This one fell out. But it's still curly, even though it fell out. Oh, there goes another one. It's coming up by itself. Still curly. for this one this one is it's gonna be an issue but it's okay This is going to be dried and it's going to be perfect for
so today I am making brown stew goat that I spoke about in our previous video when I was uh, telling Kenny that I was putting ginger in the porridge well yeah so she didn't know about brown stew goat so I made brown stew goat for her once the first time I made it she was like she's not she don't want it she don't want to eat it because she never hear about brown stew goat before a lot of Jamaicans don't brown stew goat so it was foreign for her but anyway that's what I'm making today and I'm making gungo peas rice and peas and my gungo peas is already in the pot I just put it in there it's not even boiling yet with time and I'm gonna add some garlic to that pot yeah. so I just crush some garlic and add to the pot and that's going to take some time to cook because it's dried gungo peas. It may take about maybe an hour to cook. Who knows? Whatever. I usually just test it after a while. And uh, for this pot here, I just turned the fire on. So I'm just going to season. I'm going to put oil in the pot. Season the pot. And put my goat in there and leave it to cook. That's going to take a while because I don't have my pressure cooker right now. My pressure cooker broke, so I have to use a regular pot. So it's going to take a longer time to cook, but it still, you know, does a good job. I just leave it there to do its thing. So I just cut up this ginger really fine. And I'm crushing some garlic, and I'll chop that up too. onion oh. onion some thyme and pepper I usually freeze my pepper so they're usually hard that way they don't spoil in the fridge I don't want to put a whole pepper right now because I'm not sure how hot this one is because some of them tend to be a lot hotter than others so I'll put half of this pepper for now well a little more than half Hopefully that's enough. So here we got ginger, garlic, onion, thyme, and pepper. Hot pepper. Really hot scotch bonnet pepper. And to add to that, can't forget the pimento. And my pot is really very hot right now it's just waiting I like to crush some of the pimento because I like to feel chunks of it when I'm eating so I'll crush some of it okay okay yeah I just crushed some of it see my pot it's smoking hot. So you want to season the oil before you put your meat in there. I'm going to add some brown into the pot. So I'm adding my brown into the pot.
so here you go. It's like smelling really good already. I'm just gonna add my boiling water to this. So here's my boiling water. So this is gonna cook for maybe two hours until it goes right back down to gravy. I'm almost done cooking. Well, the hardest part is done. I just have to leave it for two hours to cook and leave my peas for an hour to cook. And that's it. While this is cooking, I'll just go iron our clothes for the week, both mine and Kenny's. Veronica, her clothes will need ironing. She wears sweatshirts and sweatpants to school and stuff like that, jeans. Yes. We had a uh, victim laying on the couch with every gunshot wound. You brought all the space. Another woman kills a key witness to keep her boyfriend out of jail. She was in a gang. She participated in drug Yep, so this is... Uh, the part of my day where I iron. I don't really like it, but I gotta do it because I don't wanna look crushed or have my wife looking crushed. So I iron while I watch TV and then I'm just gonna chill for the next two hours while my food is cooking. Yeah. So usually I watch something that I don't need to look on the screen to watch it while I'm ironing. But like when I'm done ironing, I'll go watch one of my favorite shows. Like uh, I'm currently watching Handmaid's, Handmaid's Tale. My daughter got me to start watching it. Not Veronica, of course, the older one. Because it's very highly sexual. I don't know. It's not about sex, obviously, but there's a lot of that going on in that show. So I just watch something that I can listen to while I iron or sometimes just music. While Kenny works, because she sometimes works on the weekends, not all the time, but sometimes she'll do an extra weekend job or something. The one that came loose during the process is this piece. It's not properly curled. It's like it's straighter, but still blends in well. The rest, it's not too bad. Yep. Yeah. Now this busy housewife. <laughs> weekend housewife is off to get her wife from work yeah so i'm off to get my wife i want to pick her up at work and as for the food it's still on the stove. I left it to simmer because I'm done cooking. So I made the rice and peas. I made the brown stew goat. And I just left everything simmering on the stove. Veronica is there. But even if she wasn't there, I probably would have still left it simmering. I put it on simmer where it's like not even boiling. It's just like a warmer. It's keeping the food hot. Because I don't like to eat food that's warmed up I like to eat it fresh so I do that
Yeah, so I left it there and I made a uh, garden salad with tomatoes and um, tomatoes, romaine lettuce, uh, what's that green stuff called again? Um, shit. <laughs> Mm, cucumber and what else did I put in there yeah just those three things really so cucumber tomatoes romaine lettuce I might put some avocado in but I don't like to put the avocado in too early because I don't like when it starts to change color and so I didn't put that in but I will still put some in when I get back when we're actually ready to eat yeah So I'm off. So she's out. She's there waiting for me. Normally I'm the one who's waiting for her, but today she's waiting for me. Where the hell is she? Where is Kenny? She told me she was outside. Alright, I need to set my ass properly. Where did you go to get that? There's a convenience store right there. Oh, I didn't well, know that. It's like a mini mart. Okay. You have a big bump on your forehead. I know. Yeah. Okay. doing anything am I? No, 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 I just want to know we're doing what. <laughs> okay, because sometimes you feel like I'm not doing anything, I'm just watching TV. That's basically what you do on weekends. <laughs> really? Yeah. That's what I do on weekends. Jesus Christ, this weather looks so depressing. Like, I know. It's not even 5 o'clock yet and look, look what it looks like. So, you see? And I ironed and cooked and I you did all cooked? the whole work. Wow, so you can do my hair then because my hair look horrible. And I have you to do your hair tonight. Look so up. you see, I do a lot of work on the weekends and that's why I'm making this video. Uh, what did you cook though? Brown stew goat. <gasps> oh my god, like babes, I try to tell you all the time. What? When you're cooking, like... Why don't you can just tell me, like, ask me what do I want to eat? You're gonna like it. Same like yesterday, you cooked the liver. Oh, that's what I feel for. So, um... Well, if it wasn't that, we had oxtail last week. Like, what do you want me to cook? I thought you would have cooked chick um, frikaji, um, frikaji chicken. Really? You know, tada chicken. Like, when... We haven't had chicken in a while right now. That's not we true. Hadn't, no, we hadn't had chicken. Oh, we had it last week when we had the oxtail. For the, all this week, we didn't. When mm. did we have chicken? When did you even cook? All this week, you didn't cook. <laughs> exactly. I did cook, well, like twice. No, you only cooked yesterday. You really? Didn't, no. I you, didn't cook no, all week? No, you made the salt on the, the, um, what the, the pasta for you and Bron. Mm. Yeah, so I was really sick this week. I had the flu. I still, I'm still recovering from that. At least you get a break in the kitchen. Yeah. My God, this weather is so depressing. Like. Yeah, it's like really dark and gray so right now. So depressing, like. Jeez. 
Well, what you could have brunch you go with what? Rice and peas. Okay. And salad. Well, you don't really cook the salad, you just prepare it. It's a part of my <laughs> cooking. <laughs> you don't say and It is salad. a part of my cooking. And salad. I'm a full on housewife on the weekends. Housewife on Sundays. Or a housewife on the weekends. Right? You're always a housewife. I know, no, I on the weekends I do a lot of housewife things. We can call them housewife things. It's like I like to, I, I do a lot of housework and a lot of work for the family. That's what they say. Housewife. Oh, I don't want nobody to call me no freaking housewife. If that's the case, like you are a housewife. Me? Like no, I'm not. I'm just a wife, I'm not a housewife. Okay, what's the difference? Difference is a housewife just so mean. What? Yeah, it does because you're saying, oh, you're doing a housewife thing this weekend because you cook. Well, um, it don't sound mean. It sounds sexist. Yeah, it sounds sexist. Like, you know how some men would berate women and say, you know, they're just housewives or whatever. You know, they're like, these are the things that they're supposed to do. Blah blah blah. Women are not supposed to do shit. Nothing. Like, like, yeah. They like to do it. They do it like these. Oh yeah. You're supposed to be wash, cook, and wash, clean. cook, clean. Take care of the kids. Take care of your partner. And that's what housewife duties are supposed to be. Oh, wow. Supposedly. Yeah. Well, no, we're not about that life. We take care of each other. You gonna get that ear right here, so I'm feeling even that you. Why, why them the old? Why, this supposed to not come out yourself? Babe. Uh-huh. I'm the one doing your hair, right? Right. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's gonna be half, it's gonna be really, really hot. No, baby, it won't be. This is what Sunday in our house look like. Mm -hmm. We have one more photo, I thought that was the last one. Mm -hmm. So do you think that all the stuff that I do today was a lot of work? Or you just think that I have it easy every Sunday when you're gone? Hmm? No, I think you have it easy now because you're not studying or anything. So I think it's easy. You're not doing anything. So all the things that I do on the weekends, like I'll braid Veronica's hair, I'll do your hair. I'll you only cook. do that once in a while. I'll cook, iron, do the whole work. That's not a lot of work? No, I'm not saying it's not a lot of work. I'm mm -hmm. saying that it's just the norm. I do appreciate it, don't get me wrong. But I'm just saying that. Do you see yourself doing the same things that I do in one day? That's the important question. Like what? Cook and, and the, all that. All right, all the things that I do today, including doing my own hair. Do you see yourself doing all of that in one single day? I didn't make up for that, babe. You're a woman just like me, right? Hmm? You you guys always talking about yes. I know I am a female. It is clear as day. Okay. Mm -hmm. I never classify, um, classify myself as somebody else. But you say you weren't made out for that. But I wasn't. Be, not because I'm not every female were made um, to do certain things. Like, so I was made to do all the things that I did. Because in you're one naturally day. good at it. I am not. Okay. That's the whole point. I am naturally clean. Like naturally. Um, um, how I should put it like good at cleaning, good at exactly, thank you, good at um, cleaning. That's what I'm, yeah, but good you at, don't see yourself doing cooking, cleaning, that's not possible, babe. Everything in one day, mm -mm, it's not possible. Either I'm not gonna cook, or I'm gonna do, or I'm not gonna clean, or I'm not going to press. Is it I'm gonna press today and cook tomorrow? Maybe I should let you do all the stuff that I do in one day, make you do it. But it's not going to be possible. Oh, why not? Because I'm not going to do it. It's impossible for me to do. That's what I'm saying. You have to choose one out of whatever, out of all the stuff you do today. 
So, okay. So if, if if you know you want the food, I bet you tell me to cook the food, but don't tell me to cook the food. Sorry, babe. And press at the same time. It's not possible. Ow! You leave out of here, babes. I can feel it. It's just a couple of strands. Hold on. Are you gonna cut it? Yes. Why would you come by here? It's I not, babe. Part? It's not here. It's a couple of strands. It's still here, babe. Sit, the, sit down. You're moving too much. Just don't move. This is here. This. What is that? Isn't that here? Strong, Kenny. Just, just. Is stop that being a drama queen? Stop. Put that in the bag, please. There's what is. Bye guys, thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.